Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I really appreciate all the subscribers I'm getting lately. Um, I'd like to, if you like the video, don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, definitely leave a comment, let me know what you think of these not videos. Um, this video, I'm going to give a quick shout out to little Frankie. He's a, a little six-year-old boy that's just uh, infatuated with uh, fishing. He loves it. And uh, he sent me a picture of his uh, first fish. Way to go, Frankie. You keep it up. Keep up the good work. And uh, you're going to be a pro fisherman. You'll be better than me. So without further ado, we're going to get into our knot video. This video is called, uh, this knot's called the Arbor Knot. And it's for, as you can tell, I got the spool here off a reel. So it's basically a great knot for um, tying your line, whether it's braid or mono, to your um, spool. So let's just get right into it. It's a quick, easy knot. The video is going to be short, I'm afraid. But here, here it goes. You, you wrap it around. I'm going to do it in slow, like slow-mo so you can see get the thing of it. Wrap it around your uh, spool and then you're gonna go with this tag end you're gonna go underneath your line. You bring it underneath your line like that. Then you're gonna come back over like this see how you went over both of them you're going to go over both of them there and then you're going to come back up through bring it back under and then back up through that one and then pull your tag as you can see that's what you'll end up with okay now you pull that and then with this one with the tag end. Now, if you tighten this out now, this little tag end will pull out. So what you do here is you just do a quick little knot on the end of this. What you'll do is you'll wrap it, wrap it over the top of your tag end. Let's get this line out of our way. Wrap it over like that, and you just go back up, under, and through. Quick little knot. Nothing to it, tie like that. Now, when you pull on your line, see, that'll go all the way in. And then you just go like that. I normally cut that little piece off the end there. Cut your little tag end off right there before I pull it in, actually. And then when you just start reeling in, and that thing will just wrap right around there. I mean, you don't really even need to cut the tag off, as you can see. Now, don't forget that I'm using uh, some twine so you can see what is going on because with the fishing line, this camera just does not pick it up. So it's a real simple, quick knot. Let's do it one more time. We'll do it without the spool so it's easier to see. You're going to... Go under with your tag again. Let's, let's make it bigger. I'll get this out of the way. Go under with your tag again. Back over both of them. Go back up through the middle. Like that. Then you just pull that knot. And then you'll end up like that. And then with this one, you just do a little simple knot. Don't have to be nothing special. See? Just a little knot. Why oh, is it twisting like that? Here, let's do it like that. A little knot. Pull that tight. And then when you tighten this down, we'll use my hand as a spool. I'm going to get my fat fingers in there. There we go. Use that. As it, it goes in, see, it'll bring itself down and tighten. Then I would just trim that tag off, and then you could tighten it up as tight as you want, anywhere you want. You can 
loosen it back up. Nice quick arbor knot. Thanks for watching everybody. Frankie, keep up the good work. And uh, maybe I can get you out there fishing with me someday, brother. You keep up the good work, man. We're proud of you. Thanks for watching everybody.